Oh, that was a very risky pass. But we got it, though. For all your NRG innovation product needs, make sure you check out driveenergy.com. That's D-R-I-V-E-N-R-G.com. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. I'm Evil Rabbit, and today we are here Welcome on a... To Formula One. Well, they just said it for me. We're here on Formula One 2015. It was actually a game that was free with Game Pass that I downloaded. Haven't tried doing Formula One racing, so uh, I figured why not hop into this and uh, see what we can do in a Formula One race. So I believe I'm going to look for... First and foremost, I need to find options, which I can't seem to find, so we're just gonna go into quick race. Start a new quick race. Wish I knew where the option buttons were. But we are gonna just go into quick race. Start a new quick race. Yes, I'm sure. And I'm feeling like Spain, I probably know. Monaco, Canada, well, it was Canada today, so we could do Canada, Belgium, Italy, Singapore, Japan, Suzuka Circuit. The Suzuka uh, Circuit in the Mir Prefecture of Japan features some of the most famous corners in the world. The S-curves in particular. Yep, so we're going to run Suzuka Circuit. Where are we going to run? We're going to run the Ferraris, McLarens, Red Bull Toros. AMG, I feel like we're going to run the Ferraris just because Sebastian Vettel. Yep, why not? Race distance, five laps, practice, 15 minutes. We probably will not run all of it. Race settings. Sure. Breaking this off, and like breaks on, check control medium, gearbox, manual, pit assist on, there we go. So we are gonna see how this works. We can get the wheel cam turned on. We are running the sequential gearbox, so we can actually run this game correctly. We are running the NRG Innovation 350 millimeter wheel. We Good could be running the smaller wheel, but it's considered one of the greatest Formula One tracks on the racing calendar. Here we are in Japan at Suzuka for today's practice session. Okay. So now, can we set up? I think that was the wrong, but I think that's just set up with the car. Yep, that's just set up with the car. So this looks pretty sweet actually in depth, so we're just going to go into it and uh, we're going to drive out. Well, maybe. We're going to wait a second. Yeah, we're going to drive out. Or we'll go straight into a flying lap. Screw it. Flying lap it is. Alright, so this should be interesting. Oh, because it's raining. So definitely uh, going to have to get my bearings with this for a minute. I feel like I don't have to brake as hard, but this, I didn't know it was going to be raining and we're already stepping out. Well, thank you, buddy. Normally I'd be ripping my e-brake to go through that turn, but not this time. Let's see if we can follow this. Oh, Let's see if we can follow him a little bit. Get our bearings of speed to the track. Oh, we almost wrecked him because he went into the grass. Oh, okay. Car is not something to play around with, especially not in the rain. Graphics are pretty. Uh, pretty sweet actually in this game this is only 2015 but it was free 
for me to download, so that's why we are on this game today. Did I just get hit from behind? I heard a click, but... Ooh. Switch views, what kind of views we got? We got a... Looks like the overhead camera view. Yep, third person view feels weird. A little bit of a actual cockpit view. I think I like the view we were in. There we, yeah. A little late break. So, ooh. So if you guys have never tried racing F1, this is definitely a lot different than uh, normal, you know, track racing. So cars are a lot faster and uh, a lot less forgiving when it comes to uh, oversteer. Luckily we have a little bit of uh, traction control on so it's helping us a little bit. I mean, we're, oh see there we go, getting a little dicey. Okay, so that puts me at the, the top of the list. Quick breakdown, there we go. Slowly getting the handle of this. As I said, that I push a little wide, but not totally too wide, so we're okay. So I think I got a handle of this car and the handling of the game right now. So we may hop right into a lap, but I did lose my first position. And we're back down in the positions. Oh, jeez. See, I expect the car not to turn as fast as it does, but it does. Uh, yep. So I think we're going to end this session now. Uh, retire from session. Okay. Practice times are not always indicative of qualifying all race day performance, but Nico Rosberg's P1 time Oof. is impressive, and I think he'll be right up there when he's Yeah, the we're definitely tomorrow. very slow compared to all these other people, but, you know, this is my first time trying to race this, so it's definitely, uh, these cars grip a lot harder, so you think you can go, you can go through a turn a lot faster than you think you can, so uh, we're gonna, we're gonna give this a shot, and, uh, it's probably going to be it's a very bad time. Suzuka, Japan, at one of the most exciting circuits on this year's calendar. Welcome to the Japanese Grand Prix. Uh, Let's take a look at the grid positions for today's race. Where am I? I, I we can just skip to the race. I think I'm all the way in last place. Oh wow, we're we're up in front. So, we have a good starting spot. Nico Rosberg up there. Let's see if we can uh, actually uh, not wreck out right away. Try not to hit these guys. Or lose control of the car. Oh, they stopped a lot sooner than I thought they were going to. All right, so these guys are a lot slower through this section than I am. So that's a spot I know I can gain some ground. The car brakes really fast too, so that's one thing I also gotta remember. I could brake really late because the car stops so quick. We're never racing a Formula One game. And not doing too bad. It would be better if I did have paddles, but don't want to push this wide, but if we do we can run the apron, so there we go. Roll back on throttle. So we didn't get lost in the back of the pack yet, so we're still somewhat in here. Warner corner cutting. Okay, don't do that again. Unless we want to get penalized for that. We got 
They have all the rules on these. Don't lose it. We're losing it because we lost... Hey, whoa, whoa, what the heck? Yeah, I mean, come on. He hit me, so... Probably was not a very nice thing to do, but... So, you gotta be very easy on acceleration with these cars in lower speed because the back end just likes to step out. We're gonna take the inside of this guy. There we go. Back in six. It's probably a corner cutting. Maybe not? Okay, so we're good. This is actually very intense and a lot of fun. It's a lot more intense than uh, Forza Racing, I can tell you that for sure. There's a lot more uh, focus involved right now. Oh, we pushed that too high. We were able to keep it, so. I mean, F1, definitely a uh, very interesting thing. Cut the inside on him. Thank you. I'll take that back. Easy on acceleration, and we're good. DRS is being enabled this lap. We can use DRS when you are within one second of the car ahead and in the DRS zone. So that is something I'm not too familiar with, DRS zones, so um, probably will not be using those because uh, I'm not quite sure how that works. Don't know what button it is actually. That's a push. Those two fighting up there is giving me a chance to kind of catch up, so. So this is definitely a lot of fun. Cars are very grippy, very fast. And you, uh, I can see the people that are really good at this game have to have a lot of practice because this is not something you can just get in and be really good at right away. It's just like rally games, you have to have a lot of seat time, a lot of practice to be good at this. go but we seem to be holding our own in six right now so we're not last so I'm uh, pretty happy with that once again corner cut. it's that one turn I try to cut that turn way too much we're gonna stop doing that well Hamilton can, uh, I'm not far off. I'm down to 144, so that's good. Because I was at really high 150s in that practice lap. So definitely uh, getting a little more comfortable in the car. I feel like if I raced a career mode in this game, I buy a couple races, I feel like I would be way better and probably be up there in uh, P1 or P2 but for my first uh, little five lap uh, F1 race I'll take uh, I'll take P6 for right now even though I started third that's by some miracle I can catch these guys in a lap and a half and get up in their position, but that's not going to help. That could have been a lot worse. Ooh, the car will come out and point you. So, luckily, uh, we didn't spin out because that would have been the end of the race for us, and the car is not handling as well as it was before. 
probably uh, picked up some sort of damage by hitting that wall. I gotta remember not to cut this corner. There we go. Apparently I'm gonna take that corner at full speed if I wanted to. That dude was skating out of that acceleration zone. Oh, that was a very risky pass. Well, we got it though. Nice work. That, brings you up the place. that was a very uh, risky move. I didn't think I was actually going to make that. Just made a move for first. Ah! I should have tapped the brakes, but I thought he would. Green flag. Green flag. Racing again. Oh boy. It's getting sketchy on the last lap here. Trying to fight for a little bit too much. So, F1 is definitely a lot of fun. Definitely feel like maybe I will be picking up the F117 game. And having a little fun in Formula 1 racing. Because this is uh, definitely a uh, bit of a change from my normal racing. So, and it's definitely a lot more intense. I feel like we could take this seventh and maybe sixth before the end of this race. I'm almost out of gas though. I'm gonna run out of gas. That guy went really wide. I think they literally put just enough gas in for me to finish this race. Cause uh So P7 in the first F1 race. I will uh I'll take that. Um, we didn't crash out. We didn't really crash get into an incident. So I'll take uh, p7 So if you guys want to see more f1 on the channel. Let me know down in the comment section down below I had a lot of fun doing this f1 racing. Uh, yeah, that's a lot of fun. That was a little five lap stent So it would be uh, a lot more fun if this guy would not talk over me. It'd be a lot more fun probably doing a career in this so uh, if you guys want to see more F1 on the channel, don't forget to comment down below. Subscribe to the channel if you are not already a subscriber. I do appreciate all the support. So until next time, guys, you know you can follow me on Facebook, Twitch, Twitter, and Instagram. All of which are found in the description box below. Taking a look at this uh, replay to this section. This game looks like it would be a lot of fun. I'm actually very curious what 2017 is like. So I'm going to look into that. So you guys know I appreciate all the support. If you aren't a subscriber, please tap that subscribe button and hit bell notifications if you want to be the first to see the videos as they come out on the daily uploads. I got more videos coming with more games coming soon. Definitely excited for Forza Horizon 4 coming out. More Forza content as well as ESDA. So until next time, I'm Evil Rabbit. I'm out.